And welcome back to Free Play Mode! We are still doing Mario Brothers because we're gonna beat this fucking game. I doubt we're gonna beat it, but... <laughs> yeah, we're not gonna beat this fucking game. How many worlds are there, do you know? Uh, six, I think. So if we get the warp zones, I know, like, the record time for this game is, like, a minute. Are you serious? Like, the okay, speed no, Maybe not a minute. Maybe, like, five minutes. It is extremely fast. Yeah, so um, I know it can be done. There's been a bunch... I don't know what's up with it, but on oh! Twitch lately, there's been a bunch of, like, uh, those speedrun, um, uh, like, casts lately. On Twitch? Yeah. Like, there was a whole bunch of them yesterday when I was on there. Oh, oh was it Mario? Mmm, no. Oh. Some some group was... Uh, they were doing, like, a charity... Metroid. Uh, Metroid? There was a Metroid speedrun last night. You know, I've never played a Metroid game. I had one. Uh... I had it on... Oh, I have a Metroid game on the Super Nintendo. I take it as Super Metroid, then? Yeah. Oh, man. I have the Super Star Wars. Are you serious? I have two of oh, them. Is that... Okay. Um, do you know if one of them is the one where uh, Luke has, like, his lightsaber and just he goes ape shit with it and he just destroys everything? Uh, yes. But that game was so hard. Um, it just... Oh, wait, playing wait. it, like, I, I remember playing it a lot when I was a kid, but I played, like, the first, like, three levels so much that I got burned out because I couldn't beat them. Uh, <laughs> like, it was, that game was hard to play. Yeah, I understand. You know, oh, fuck. Nah, never mind. I was gonna say, I want, I'm going to complete Majora's Mask on this, but I really doubt I can. Well, maybe. Fuck. I really want, like, a Majora's Mask on the 3DS. Have you, have you played uh, Ocarina of Time 3D? Nah. Oh my god, it looks so much better than the original Ocarina of Time. That's than the, the 64 one? <laughs> it's, I mean, it's amazing. The uh, I mean, it's amazing. It's not really amazing. I mean, if it came out on the Vita, maybe it would look amazing. Oh, but, what an asshole. What? I wasn't saying because you oh. don't have a Vita anymore. <laughs> For those of you that don't know, Steen had his Vita stolen by a crackhead while he was at work. <laughs> um... But not an employee, another a customer. Yeah, yeah, it was, stole it. yeah, it was a customer crackhead. Uh, oh god. Oh fuck. Whoa. There's been so oh. much good shit coming out for the Vita lately, too. Really? <laughs> They've been like re releasing games and oh. coming out with new stuff. Yeah, that's true. They have do they have been doing a lot of re Oh, what the fuck? I've been doing that how many times now? <laughs> okay. I can Doesn't mean you're good at it. I can do this. I can do this. Oh yeah. Okay. So uh yeah, Ocarina of Time three D. That was the that was the big thing that I really didn't like about Ocarina of Time is that Link looked really, really bad. Yeah, uh, I could see that. Yeah, I mean, low poly is one thing, but Link had, like, six polygons for his entire body. <laughs> uh, <laughs> which he doesn't look much better in Majora's Mask, but it does look slightly better because of that expansion pack. Um, but with Majora's Mask, it had that, like, uh, it has this, like, dark energy about it, so it feels like there's impending doom. With Ocarina of Time, it's like, the the whole premise of the story is that it is like a whole... Oh, 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 yeah, no! Oh, fuck me. Uh, it is like a whole end-of-the-world situation because Ganondorf has taken over, but you never feel like it's like that important. With uh, Majora's Mask, you see the moon like coming at you all the time. I don't know, maybe it's just because I, Majora's Mask was the very first game I ever pre-ordered. I, like, begged my parents, please, please, this can be my Christmas present. It can be my birthday present. I just want the gold cartridge. <laughs> oh, because it was a special edition thing? Eh, it wasn't It wasn't special edition at all. It was just a gold cartridge. <laughs> Which, actually, it turns out the gold cartridge is more common than the gray cartridge. <laughs> Oh, really? Yeah. So having not pre-ordered it would have probably been better financially? Probably, but I'm not ever going to sell that. No, thing. I agree. I probably won't ever sell my 64 on my NES. Yeah, well, the the only reason I don't have my SNES, SNES and NES anymore, oh, fuck, is because when my nephew, my first nephew was born, uh, oops, my sister, she wanted to play video games with him, but she couldn't wrap her head around, like, 3D games. I think she got him a GameCube at first, and uh, she was just like, I have no idea how to do anything. <clears throat> so she asked me if she could have the NES and SNES, 
And I said yes, but his father had a drug addiction, and he pawned everything. Oh. The only thing that I had left was Bonkers. <laughs> bonkers was the only game that I had left. What the fuck hit me? His, his foot, toenail? His foot. This is fucking bullshit. <laughs> his toenail, like, jammed out my eye or something. Ugh. But uh, now it looks like Bonkers is gone, too. I know, I don't, uh, I don't know. We, or I recently moved, and my, uh, my N64 games, all of them, and uh, my Bonkers is gone. Huh. Yeah, no idea what happened to it. Oh, I think there's a thing in... Nope, nope. <laughs> <laughs> That's a secret. <laughs> <laughs> That's a warp zone. <laughs> it takes you all the way to Bowser. Oh, shit! Holy Wow. Fuck. Oh, my God. I thought this was the second level. <laughs> Um. Oh my god! 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 Fuck! <laughs> wow. Uh, the only reason I have Majora's Mask still is because I let my old roommate use my N64, and he wanted to play Majora's Mask, which I don't think he ever did. Did you have um? Was it Cruising USA? We had for three, the Super Nintendo. We did not have. Oh no 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 for the 64. I, no, we didn't have. My my dad believed that the consoles we were killing our arcade business. So, uh, uh, all right. <laughs> I, those kind of games that weren't console exclusive, I was not allowed to get. We had three actual Cruising USAs, like the one where you sit down with the with the wheel. No, uh, yeah. I remember that game on the the 64. Uh, oh, yeah. What was the other one? Cruising oh, Exotica? Rush 2000. That was one of my favorite games on the 64. I don't remember that at all. Oh, it was it was this game that had, like, again, it was one of those unrealistic things where it was, you could do these, like, really, really, really ridiculous stunts in your car. Uh -huh. And, like, you could do, uh, like, all these tumbles and flips and backflips and stuff by hitting, like, a ramp just right. <laughs> that sounds awesome. What was it called? Rush 2000. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try to buy that. Ugh. It was on the 64. Oh, I need to get more 64 controllers. Uh, I think I have one, but the only one that I can find <laughs> is that one that's that big-ass fat one <laughs> that say, nobody likes. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say, was it one of those third-party ones that always fucking sucks? Oh, my God. I hated that because Ronnie had three controllers and then one of those. <laughs> Everyone. And so, like, if them. you didn't get to the box quick enough to get your controller, <laughs> you were stuck with the fat man controller. <laughs> it was horrid. I know exactly what you mean. Everybody had that controller, though. It was... Uh, the purple one was always the best. Yeah, I think I have... Yeah, I do have the purple one. I think I have it, too. I just don't know where it's at. Oh, oh here's Rush 2049. Is that what it is? No, it was called Rush 2000. No, I see Rush 2049 for uh, N64. What's it look like? It's like this. No, that's not it. There, oh. it's, it's called Rush 2000. Okay, okay, I'll Google it. Uh... Everybody had that controller, though. I remember... Uh, well, it came with the console, I think, didn't it? Not the purple one. I mean the fat one. The third-party controller. Oh, that, that's... Could, a, that only semi-worked. Like, it was... It wasn't... I don't even think it was made by Mad Cats, because Mad Cats was like, fuck that. Like, it, <laughs> Mad Cats wasn't that mad. <laughs> like... <laughs> they were like, fuck this. <laughs> that's way too much to do R&D for. I don't know why it was so hard to make N64 controllers uh, in particular, though. Because, like, I, I remember my really shitty PS2 controllers that, you know, the, uh, the oh, 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 you did the same thing that I did. Um, but the PS2 controllers, I had, like, one official one, and then my parents were like, $50 for a controller. Well, actually, my dad was like that. My mom was never like that. My dad was like, $50 for a controller? We could buy a new, a new game for that. And I was like, yeah, but I need a second controller for two players. Yeah. And uh, we got this. We got a... Fuck that. You're going to play alone. You're just going to have 60 games. <laughs> <laughs> I know. He's like, you enjoy your Final Fantasy X-2 that's taking you like a whole fucking month to play. <laughs> actually, that did take me a really long time to play. But I eventually got... It was a Mad Cat's controller. It was like... Ooh. It was like... Mm, it like maybe like 50% bigger than the normal one. Oh my god, I forgot how heavy this thing is. Um, it's like 50% bigger than the normal controller. Oh my god, I did that again. Did you see it? No. Oh shit. 
uh, and it had like these weird. It was a blue controller with this with these bright yellow grips, and the control or the buttons were like spaced slightly apart. <gasps> oh, a mushroom! Now I can just run through him. Oh, fuck you! Yes. Uh, so the, the buttons were spaced slightly apart, so if you didn't get the normal control, oh my god, the normal controller, and you're used to the normal controller, you were just completely screwed for whatever game you had, because your, your, uh, oh shit, your reflex movements were just completely off. And I remember, ah, oh, fuck, I remember playing uh, Tekken Tag with, with somebody who tried to use that controller, and it would constantly, I'd hit like, oh, damn it. I would constantly hit like the wrong button, you're up, Steve. I would constantly hit, like, in between the buttons, and uh, I would constantly get my ass kicked for it. But, yeah, every, everybody had that, that shitty third-party controller. Because it was so much cheaper, I think, too. Oh, yeah, it was. Like, actually, I remember the price of that controller because, uh, because it was such a big deal when I got it. It was nineteen ninety nine <laughs> instead of forty nine ninety nine, and I was like, "Look at the price difference, Mom! Please, please, can I get a second controller?" <laughs> and then what sucked is my actual PS two controller died, <laughs> so I had to use that for all of my games. Jeez, uh -huh. you need to get a uh, Nick over here and play Super Smash Brothers, the original one. I don't have it. I think Nick does. Well, good for him. <laughs> good for you. All right. Well, I'm ready to get up on this game. Are you? All right. All right. Well, <laughs> you got to see us fail enough. So see you next time. <laughs> see ya. <laughs>